Hello, welcome back to RimWorld. I'm, I'm sorry I cut that episode a bit short and left it on a cliffhanger. Uh, I, but I know myself, if I had gone and gone through that fight, it would have been an hour long uh, ordeal. So, um, what's going on here is we have a, a visitor, an angry visitor named Zoodles, who has a gun. And Zoodles wants to kill all of us. Um, Zoodles luckily isn't that best, isn't the best at, at shooting. However, she's not a bad person, so if we can capture her, that would be alright. Uh, so we'll get everyone geared up and ready to go fight her. I don't think we have a lot. How many arrows do we have? You have six. Um, there's one there. And you have how many? You have 12. It's not a lot, but hopefully it's enough to take him down, take her down. We do have the wild woman here also. And he's carrying her into this bedroom, which is very hot. I think actually the best solution might be just to throw her in the cooler here. So if I just come in here and I throw down a um, sleeping spot right there, and make this a prisoner room, and make that nothing. Okay, now go and capture her. Throw her in there. Okay, how are you feeling? Extreme, 99%. Oh, that's rough. That's at 36. I think the threshold is somewhere around 40 where they start getting heat strike, if I remember correctly. So, hopefully, she will survive this. Uh, I do want to make sure this door is closed. So we'll keep this as the cool room. And we can see if we can get her on our side. She's an independent wild woman. <laughs> uh, uh, in, yeah, incapable of caring. Okay, so uh, next stop. Do we want to really want to feed her? She says she's hungry. Emergency is get the best, best medical care. I don't think I can actually tend to her. I can just feed her. Um, I'll put you on warden just a little bit. Can you do anything to her? You can just feed her, but that's, not, that's the least of our problems, I think. We need to go deal with the guy with a gun. So, Mirandal... Walk through that door. Shut the door. Correct. Yeah, should shut. Um, grab your bow. And let's go up this way. York, I want you... Where do we fight her at? She's coming here. I'm assuming her bow, her gun is a lot better range than my, than my stuff. Um, I need to set up like a, a bunch of rocks here. Maybe I should put in... I can't do it right now, but maybe I should put in like a pile of rocks. Just some sort of barrier over here. We don't really have much of a defensive spot. Randall over here. Let's fight her, I guess, behind it. We can hang out behind these rocks. When she gets up to this point, we pop out and shoot her. Or behind the trees, it might actually work. But we'll wait for her to get closer, because I think her range is better. Let's come over here. York over this way. Okay, here she comes. Okay, so you're going to go shoot her as soon as you can. When she gets right about there, I want you to fire at her there, and York, pop on out, and start shooting. What are you doing? She's just standing there. Why aren't you guys shooting? There comes a shot. What are you shooting at? Did you just shoot my turkey? No. Okay, good. There's one shot. Attacking Mirandal. Um, arrows are flying. That's a bad shot. You hit the tree. Okay, you missed. You hit the, the wall. Nice. Usually I'm a pacifist, but you asked for it. <laughs> nice. Party time. Oh, come on, come on. She's bleed. Oh, headshot. Uh, who took it? York. Um, was it by uh, health? Um, you're right. I. Oh, she shot you in the eye. Oh. Um, her bullet missed Miranda and shattered York's... Oh, you were shooting at Miranda and you shot York in the eye. When are you bleeding out? In one hour. Um, I'm just going to let you go. You'll bleed out very soon, right? What if we just go and hide? Come over here and hide. Fire your shot. Okay, now go. No, Miranda got shot. Okay, go faster. Go faster. Go faster. Okay. Um, I need you not be that anymore. I need you to... Can you... you can't, I, let's make this a doctor bed. Actually, I guess they, this can be both a medical bed, because they're both hurt. Um, and... Can you pick up some of these on the way? Pick up some herb, herbal meds. Who's the best doctor? Doctor is York. Who, neither of them are any good. Pick up... Yeah, all of them. On the way. And you go to bed. Hopefully you'll bleed out by the time... You get to the base. There we go. She's down. 
Okay. Um, let's make this a prisoner room. How are you doing, Miranda? Let me take a look. You got 10 hours to go, and you have... You're actually okay. I mean, your eye's gone. Um, I think I would like you to self-tend yourself. Picks up your eye. Just, you know, stuff some cotton in there or something. And then we're going to get some zoodles. We're going to stabilize zoodles. Um, well, no, no. We're going to stabilize... We're going to save Miranda and then zoodles. Probably won't make it. I don't want to waste my. I don't want to waste my stuff on this. Take care of our own first. Take care of our these two, and then if if we can, we'll go get Zoodles. Zoodles will be bleeding out. I would like to get at least get her clothing. Okay, now I want you to immediately run over here, and strip her. We'll see how long the timer is. Ten seconds. No, we're not going to make it. Five. Four, maybe. Come on. Nice. Okay, and she's dead. Excellent. What timing. And look at those fancy pants. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, and you got a, uh, a bib apron. You got a fancy gun. Nice. And uh, it's like 10 bullets there. I will take them. And you need to go tend to your fiance, please. How you going? Uh, how's it going, Allie? Heat stroke is up to... Uh, heat stroke is at 85%. It's going down. Excellent. It's nice, cool. 25 degrees in there. 41 in here, which is terrible. Um, but we'll get him patched up. Man. Man. Okay. Well, we made it. it. Wasn't pretty, but we made it. Unforbid, whatever things there are out there. A couple arrows out there, I guess. We need to get more... Oh, she can walk around now. We need to get more arrows made. York, what are you doing? Oh, you're going to go do that because this is... Are you completely healed? Yeah, can we make this into a non-medical bed so you can sleep there? Um, go get in bed. Okay. So, you don't have an eye anymore, which is going to hurt your um, your aim, isn't it? Um, where is it? It's in um, bio? Does it not hurt your aim any? I thought it did. I know it does more than just a little, than just minor things. I mean, your eyeball is missing. And you, um, you just got a, a shot in the foot. No big deal. No big deal. At least your eye is still there. Okay. So... We made it. We have a turkey. Everything's okay. And here's what I here's what I think I want to do. I've, I have been talking about this. And I haven't been doing it, and that is having separate buildings. I would like to get some sort of a cooking thing set up. I think this episode is is uh, electricity time. Uh, we gotta get her buried also. So um, we may set up a whole separate building. We'll remove some of this fence and build a building over here as like a kitchen. Uh, and all of that. We can get a... Uh, it'd be nice to have an oven. Even if it doesn't have electricity, an oven that will be able to, uh, like, bake bread. If, if we get some wheat in here. I don't think we even have wheat growing, do we? York is starving. York, can you, um... Hey, buddy. How you feeling? Can you go, uh... Can you go and, uh, feed your wife? Oh, here, get up. Go get some food. Where are you going? Is there only food? Over is there no food in here? Oh, because this is a prisoner room. Um, here. Should move on our own, I think. Let me just remove. This is not for prisoners anymore. There we go. That's the problem. I forgot about that. I, I mentioned it, then I forgot about it. Okay, go have a bite to eat. She, uh, well, she'll go ahead and eat some things. That's okay. Uh, I mean, it's not okay, but, but I'll let it slide. And uh, let me go throw in a grave. I'm going to put, like, we always have to have these graves for people that, that come across your base, and I don't want, I, I'm going to have a separate, if any of my, so let's say any of my colonists die, they'll have their own grave, their own grave area, and people that I don't like, they can get buried somewhere else. You know what, they just get thrown over here somewhere. All unimportant, like, because they are unimportant. I realize people go and, 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 sit by the graves every once in a while. Hopefully they will go and sit by... Like, if, if it's my people, they can be in the base, you know? At a, uh, a nice spot of respect. How's that going over there, Istanbul? How's those eggs coming? I notice he's at tame as five of five, so I guess we got that under control. He doesn't, we can't do anything of these. Um, but it's, we don't care about that. All we care about is you laying some eggs. Turkey wants accepted it and joined Randall's community. We should have a history thing over... Oh, no, story is what we want. Animals went mad in the second, and now in the 11th, dragonflies of torture. Attacked your colony. Well, and they failed. Okay. 
So, um, let's see. Am I going to have to, um, I'm going to have to rest her, aren't I? Take her to a bed. I guess I don't have to rest her. She's already here. And I should have you under prisoner. And I do want to recruit you. You're actually pretty easy to recruit. You get a little bit of resistance, but no big deal. I'll take you. I think you're all right, right? You're not bad. You've got some good melee skill. You're a vengeful child. Um, you're a good, a good grower. Heat wave is over. That is amazing. That is fantastic. Okay. That is great. Um, all right. So we got a bunch of rice, cotton. Uh, we may be able to turn cro uh, rice into flour. Um, I think this probably is enough for just two people. We can't really handle any more of this, though. The meat, we're spoiling in four hours. So we got to get some cooking done. This court is in ten hours. So, yeah, keep on making those meals, please. Uh, as soon as Miranda's up and, uh, and working, we're going to have him go make ourselves a new kitchen area. And I think what we'll do is... It can be kind of small, I guess, to begin with, but I, uh, I'm i going to remove some of this fence that I put in. Um, remove all that. And let's just remove all this for now. We'll rearrange some of it. Really, the only fence part, I guess, needs to be the farm and the turkey area. Because they, wild animals that come in here, we may need to build a fence around this. Like a duck pond, I guess. Um, to keep some sort of... Any wild animals coming in from just, and just chewing its face off. Um, I have this set over here. We could put it on this side. And then block it off. No, I want it over here. Just because I want the, all the farming and growing and all that over this way. It just makes sense. How's it going, Miranda? How's, uh, how, how's it feeling? Uh, let's see. Where is your health? Uh, my button. There it is. Needs. Serious pain minus 10. Darkness. Yeah, we haven't got that set up yet either. Low expectations. That's the idea. Recreation satisfied. Perfect. Spacious interior. You like your fiance. That's okay. Uh, it's a little bloody in here, but the bed is, uh, well, minus one. How's your room in here? Awful. 12. Oh, uh, whatever. Let me fast forward here until uh, Miranda gets up, because there's not much we can do without that. Our moods have, have dipped slightly. But they're still not terrible. What is that? Where are you? Oh, a tapir. Okay. All right. Any more? Uh, any animals come back into the uh, into the world? Not really. Chipmunk is walking back in. Uh, research. What are I, I'm working on batteries right now, which is what we want. Because as soon as we get batteries done, which is never going to happen, but as soon as the batteries get done, we will get uh, power. Oh, my venison just rotted away. Describe reconsidering her ideas to um, her. Told her about boxers. That's an exciting story. The dog? Uh, this one needs wood, too, to keep it cool in here. It's still... It's hotter inside than it is outside because of that that uh, heat wave. Um, we need to get her buried. We need to get this gun equipped. And we know York is the better fire, a uh, better shot. She's a 9, and he's a 7. They're both pretty good, but we're going to give it to York. Sherry York. As soon as she gets up, we'll let her uh, snooze here. As soon as she wakes up, we're going to go give her that. We'll let her equip that and the uh, and the ammo. Uh, ammo. Ammo. Um, you're not quite up yet. So go equip that. You should drop your bow along with this as well. Why did it just go uh, like that? Go equip that. And I want you to pick up the ammo. There you go. Okay, so you should be good. You, do you still have a bow? You shouldn't have the bow anymore. You should... Oh, you're carrying it. Drop that. And equip the bow. There you go. Now you're good to go. And you got ten bullets for this thing. Drop those arrows also. That one arrow you got. Um, I don't how many arrows you got left. You got six arrows. Okay. That'll be right. Okay, you're gonna go finish chopping some wood. Uh, where's the uh, clothing? We all picked this stuff up. What about the fancy pants? Anyone who has any of those? Uh, where's your gear? You're wearing a t-shirt, apron, and fancy pants. And you're wearing that tribal wear. So if you take the tribal wear off... Can you wear pants, too? Where are those pants? Those are some nice-looking pants, too. They're 95%. Here, drop, drop the tribal wear. You're not naked, though. Do You probably like this a little more, don't you? It's all corpse. Yeah, that happens. Ratty apparel. What is, um... What's ratty? Oh, your, your apron just fell apart. Hmm. Okay. I actually may want to keep those. Actually. 
A whole story about Mercy. I asked her about her family, about her accent. Well, you talk funny. Okay, we're getting our loom set up, preparing for our cotton. Uh, we're going to get a lot of cotton in here. Well, a little bit of cotton anyway. And we got to get a grave dug. We need to do that right now. Uh, York, can you go uh, do that? How much longer till this stuff is rotten? Oh, there isn't any. Um, you make, you're grilling steak with mushrooms? Do you have any meat? Steaks. Take... It's all just meat, right? Mushrooms. You can make... Oh, steaks out of mushrooms. Really? Is that a thing? I know that... I know mushrooms are... Um, like, if you want something to taste meaty, like a soup or something, you add mushroom to it because that's... It's a... Um, is it like umami or whatever? Um, um, but uh, I've never heard of that before. Who has the flu? Two of your colonists... Okay. A Shandy and Marundel have the flu. This is what I'm mostly worried about on these kind of playthroughs. So, uh, the flu is bad news. Um, do we have any meds? We've got a little bit. So, York, don't worry about burying that person. Go and tend to Marindel. We've got... How many of those do you have on you? You have two more. I'm tempted to not use any on her. Hmm. Well, let's go do it. You. Can you go and, uh, uh... You? Can you go, uh, take care of her? She has the flu. Um... Hmm. Alright, never mind. Go do what you want to do. Sorry, uh, Allie. You're just, uh, just out of luck. Randall, let me take a look at you. So your flu is at 1.6, your immunity is at 1. We need to make sure that catches up. Um, we're going to have to do everything we can to make sure immunity stays in front of the flu. Which it is not. Um, if we can clean up the room here a little bit. Let's go clean up the blood. I'm actually going to put you on just all cleaning. Not crafting. Um, cleaning. Keep everything clean in here. We can change the floors out, I guess. Would help as well. We're almost there. to three. We're just behind it. Hopefully it'll catch up. Do a bit more cooking. Uh, you didn't um, clean that up. Clean up that, that and the rest of that dirt in there. How's the room looking now? Slightly impressive. Okay. Now, in order, we could also put down, we don't have any silver here, so we can't do anything, any better floors or anything, but this is probably the best room for him to be in for the health. Um, and remember when I was talking about this being like electricity day and all that? So much for that. Yeah, I'm glad we didn't heal her because we need the heal every heal root we got to keep uh, him alive. And I'm probably going to have to have her go and yank out some more heal root. If we can find some down here. There's uh, there's one at 92%. Let's go grab that one. Uh, let me just pick them all here and just harvest them. And York. Change my mind. Cleaning. It's back down. Plant cutting is a priority. Go and yank these out of the ground. And hopefully we'll get a couple of them that work. Oh boy, we've got a husky. A timber wolf, I mean, coming in. Okay, as long as it doesn't eat my turkey, I'll be okay. Okay, did you get that one? Uh, here, um, come and grab this one also. Well, those arrows just laying around over here. And then I want you to come to that one. Oops, I didn't hold shift down long enough. And then you can come and pick it up. There you go and grab all those. And um, don't forget that one. Nope, nope, nope. I think if I say haul, you'll carry them all. There we go. Okay. That gives us a nice stockpile of those. Well, a few of those anyway. You are um, barely hanging in there. We can tend to you again in five, or in two hours. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, she already has immunity with a, with a flu? How'd that happen? Do I really want to use this on her? Um, yeah, fine. Fine. 
I'm not happy about it, but we'll do it. It's so hot in here. It's so hot outside. Okay, you're going to feed her. we got 21 steaks laying around, which is going to be good for how much longer? One day. Great. Interested in her appearance. Oh, yeah? Asked her about her eyes. Do you have two eyes? <laughs> um, keep talking. Interest in her forehead. Okay, down to 7.7. 7. Uh, he needs treatment, so let's go tend to him. I make sure your doctor is is top priority. Yeah. Keep him happy. You uh, do you have any more on you? You have four on you. So that probably will get you through the uh, the sickness. I think. Twelve. Flume's at thirteen. Hmm. How are you doing? Flume's at fifteen. Immunity twelve. I need some better meds. What are you doing? Throat plates and more shoes? Hmm. There's a bit more right there at 98%. Any more around? There's a bunch up there. Let's go uh, harvest all that we can. And she should go on automatically go to do that. Okay, Miranda, I'm watching you. We're up to... Uh, we're right about breaking even. Just a bit behind. And let me see if there's any flooring I can do here to help this out. I know that metal tiles are nice. Sterile tile, of course, is the thing you want. If I if I made this into a, a medical bed, would that change something? Would that help? She's going to sleep in the cooler. She won't be happy about it, but I'm going to see if this actually makes a difference. Infection chance multiplier from room, 54%. Because the room is dirty. Let's see if that helps you any. Being in what is technically a medical bed. I don't think it does. It's very important you don't die though, buddy. All I can really do is bring in the uh, herbal meds. How you doing? And it just barely keeps up with it. She's three percent behind, two percent behind, and has been for a while. He's just barely behind. I think it's catching up though. Where'd that come from? You drop your rice. We make sure she stays happy and fed. Go and eat that steak before it goes bad. It's gone in seventeen hours. Then we're gonna be out of food. Hmm. Uh, we have rice over here that we can we can harvest though, so no big deal. Um, it's fine. Go use it on her. Go use it on her, and then um, how's he feeling? We just make sure we feed. Yeah, f are you feeding him? Feed him first, and when you're done with that, then you can go feed her. Yeah, leave the rice laying there. We don't need that. Ask her about her beliefs. Those numbers. 26 flu, 26 immunity. It's right. Almost is almost even. I think it's slowly, very slowly gaining, so I think we'll actually make it. It's not pretty though. Grab some more hero. Excellent. Toss it in there. Um, it'd be nice if we built this thing. I think. There's some more hero coming in. It'd be real nice if we could get just like one thing of medicine. That's all I ask for. What are you? What are you looking at, Timber Wolf? That's a harvestable heel root. He's gonna come eat my turkey. I just know it. I just know it. I should lock that turkey in here. Does he not want to be? He wants to not be in there maybe anymore. Let's take the Miranda. How much longer have we got here? Nine hours. Keep on feeding all we can with it. I think if I get an oven also, I can make jerky, I believe. Oh, you're not going to chew on her, are you? Okay. Are you hungry? Not quite. I'm really worried about you. Oh, boy. Now you're walking into the base. Why do I have to have a hole there? Uh, listen here, Istanbul. I got a new spot for you. Uh, your spot is not going to be in here. This is where you live. Uh, I may give you food. Um, I might not. Whatever I feel like, okay, buddy? 
Right, get rid of all that. You cannot be in there anymore. You got to be in that spot there and stay away from that wolf. He's eyeballing you. There's some berries that are about ready to be grown. Yeah, just walk by him. It's okay. If he starts getting hungry, we'll go feed him manually. Um, I'm going to go um, harvest a couple of these. Just keep some berries around. Make sure everyone's topped off on food before that stuff spoils. I'm really micromanaging some things here, but... Go there. Now, eat some steak. Seven hours left. Okay, how you doing, buddy? The immunity is better. Is better. Okay, we've surpassed that. Excellent. How are you doing? You're still three behind. I don't know if you're going to make it. Uh, I can have you clean. Can you clean this room? You tried to lame. Tried to tame. Tried to tame. There you go. Where are you going to go? You're going to go grab some of those. Okay. Okay. And how, how are you doing? How are you looking? Probably shouldn't be wasting my heel root on her. I think we're okay though now. She's got four left. Stop botching the harvest. Hey, look at that. Four. Okay, where are you going? Are you going to go try to heal her? And she might be a little too far gone. I might, be, I might be just be wasting this stuff. There are thrombos in the area. Okay, you're going to go take a nap. Uh, before you nap, we've got three hours left of this. Go ahead and top off your food. And you're going to feed everybody else too while you're at it. If you can. Nope. Okay, so that's it. Um... Hey, you want some rotten food? Hmm. I can move you in here to eat that. It's alright. Where are they at? There he is. Okay. We know you'll make it, right? Tended in a half an hour. Immunity is at the 40. Yeah, immunity is just barely ahead of the flu. Can be tended to now. Uh, let's go ahead and do it. I don't want to lose. We can't lose any any time. There we go. You're good to go. You're going to go take a nap. And you are... Yeah, still behind. Not not gaining any ground. I think we stopped, we stopped healing her. No meds. You're done for. Um... I wish there was a way of seeing, like, at this rate, whether you will survive or not. But I don't know if I want to spend any more meds on you. It doesn't seem... It, it's gained a tiny bit, but not enough, I don't think, to make it. To make it. So, I'm sorry, wild woman. Uh, there's the, uh, the AI message for finding a ship and getting out of here. I shot out... Um... And you're, I'm panicking about this, so... Oh, York, will you go pick up that gun? Why'd you, why'd you put it down? Why'd you put it down again? Hmm. Are you set with a, um... Where's the manager for the gear? Um... Why are you grabbing this? Don't grab that. Equip that. How do I set up, um, where's that at? This one. Uh, yeah, yeah, I forgot. I, mean, I, didn't, I didn't make this, didn't I? So, uh, no bow for you, and I guess I can make a new loadout, loadout here. Is there anything that's, uh, pre-made in here? No. So, York is going to have, we have the end field. That one there. Um, uh, you can carry three drugs. I guess it's going to be medicine. Uh, you can also carry meals or, um... Potatoes? So that's rice. Or can I just say, um, that's all I'm gonna uh, everything. Um, meals? That's just gonna be simple meals or whatever. Food in general? No. Um, well, we do need ammo. Was that 303? Yeah. Um, really any of these. Um, so, um, yeah, we're gonna say 303 and take. 
I guess, any of these and have like, I don't know, 30 of each one. There you go. It's a little bit much. Let's just do like, I don't know, 25 of the full metal jacket. There you go. 23. Okay. So you'll have a gun and the cartridges and then whatever else you want to wear. It's going to be overburdened, but you're not going to have all the ammo. It's just so that you have it. Uh, I guess that'll work. Okay, go get some berries brought in here. Um, let's see. You're going to feed her. Is that what we want to do? If she's going to die, do we really want to be feeding her? And she's just not going to make it. So I think maybe... Hiker. She's got a she's got the nice scar across her face. She looks good. Uh, but unless we get some meds, she's done. I don't know any way we can make her make it any better. Where are you going? Get some mushrooms. Oh hey, hey. There's a kit right here. There's medicine right there too. And there's a uh, nasty deer. Uh, can you come get this one also? Can you get both of those. Uh, how do I do this? Can I say that? No, no, no. Uh, pick up. And haul. Don't worry about the deer. Any more down here? A bunch of arrows. Somewhere way down here that we can we can harvest. Okay, how's your how's your food looking there, buddy? Not looking good. Uh, the wolf I think is gone. Oh, way over there. Um, you know what? I think, uh, where's animals? Animals. You are free to go back into, um, I'm just put you in the home zone. Just go wherever you want. Just don't eat my potato, my, my rice. Okay, hold those berries back. Perfect. The cotton is ready to be harvested, which means bandages. Bandages are actually worse than the herbal meds. Wait, why did, he, why is the immunity going down? Why is uh why is the flu higher now? What happened? Visitors have arrived. They're afraid to enter because there's no guest beds. No, no, no. I'm sure things will be fine. Come on in. People from Colon to Baran are here. Um, I could set this as a guest bed. No, just hang around the place. Don't worry. Things won't. Don't think bad things won't happen. They do have things to trade though, right? They seem to have a few items to trade. Yeah. Um. What chances do you guys have medicine? I really need some medicine. Hey, Tiffy. You have medicine. Okay, give me all your medicine. What can I sell you? I can sell you a bow. I can sell you some tribal wear. Some 83, uh, whatever, tribal wear. Um, okay, we'll take um, four of those. Nope, three of those. I can't give you anything else. But three medicine might be enough to do to do it. You got survival, you got survival medicine. Man, you got some good stuff. Okay. Um, yeah. Take those meds and treat him. He doesn't need tending for a while. We could actually... We How many did you get? Three? We might be able to save her now. You know? What are you drinking? What was that? Soda. Can I have some soda? You're going to go feed her the last of our food, basically. Um, if anything happens to York, I'm, um... Let's see. I'll put you back on the herbal meds. When do you get tended? In 12 hours. Okay. Not for a while. So, while you're out here, come and harvest all of this. And there's a turkey that came along. A wild turkey. You are a male turkey. I don't want you. Unless we want more. Unless we get some turkey eggs. That's out there. We can come take care of that. Uh, you're going to feed her the berries. No, no. Just drop those. And, and what are you doing? Oh, recruiting her. Okay. Um, you know what we could do, actually? We could try making something and then selling it to them. To get more meds. She's not much of a crafter. She's actually not much of a crafter at all. Uh, but if she were to make something, let's say we can make... We got wood out here, right? We got 29 wood. What can we make with 29 wood? We can make maybe a bow. It takes 10 wood. Make a couple bows. Finish chatting with her. York, you're the savior of the colony, by the way. 
Right, we're at 34 minutes. I need. To, I really need to call it a day here, but uh, I can't. Go make some wood. Even though he's hungry, I'll feed him some berries in a minute. Make. I say make wood. Make a uh, make a bow. Get very slow at this. Cargo pods. What do you what, what you got? What you got for me? What is that? Dire wolf wool. Okay, I'll take it. Hmm. How much is this bow going to sell for? It's going to be a low quality bow. Alright, fine. Just go uh, go feed the poor guy. Okay, he's now happy. You're going to go to sleep. Yeah. Um, you probably should rest. I'm trying to cook some... Cook some yeah, oh, that's my silver. Oh, you don't want the bow, do you? I tried... Oh, if it was in my stockpile, I, you would want it. I have arrows, too. I could probably sell you. If I make, um... Like that. And I can probably do a talk to you. You want my bow? You do want my bow for two bucks. Right. I already bought one of those and it was worth nothing. I need 24 in order to buy that, so I'm a little bit short still. I'll have to buy some nice tribal wear or something. Uh, and I, I can't do that. I mean, some of the same tribal wear that I sold you back to me for 177. You guys are swell. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna sell it. I'm gonna keep it. Okay, back to bed. Okay, three meds. Plenty. We're already halfway through. Um, Ali up here is... 4% behind now. That good medicine might do it, though, for her. Oh, caravan is approaching. They're a bulk goods trader. Oh, look at that. we got more folks coming in to trade with us. Hmm, folks with turkeys again. Okay. Transport pod crash. A glitter world empath named jo uh, Yakim is crashing a transport pod nearby. He survives. He'll be badly wounded. He's a He is from these people that are visiting us. If we rescue him, he may uh, join um, and spread goodwill and all that. Uh, let me put in a sleeping spot. Actually, let's just build this bed. Can we just install it there? Um, my, my base is getting all all ruined. Uh, Sherry, where's this guy at? Oh, it's right there. Alright, Yakim bleeds out in four hours. Misogynist, depressive, vi incapable of violence. Oh, you're terrible. Not really that terrible, but you don't trust women. Um, you're just parentally unhappy. I don't want you. I do want your clothes, though. What are you wearing? Sorry, things are turning dark here in, in real world. You got some nice pants, a nice shirt. Um, yeah, I think I do want that. How long you wait till you uh, till you bleed out? Four hours. So in three and a half hours, she will wake up and come strip the guy and throw him in a grave. As soon as he, uh, keep an eye on his on this. Then we can go chat chat with Princess over there. Maybe get some maybe more meds. How's your uh, health looking? Need you in three hours. Okay, um, I'm waking you up now because I'm gonna go deal with a lot of things here. Go and strip the guy. Okay, now um, you want to eat. Can you... Let's just go trade with these guys and see what they want. Maybe they want to buy... I don't know. Maybe they want to buy rocks. You guys like, you guys like rocks? I could buy my... I could sell my turkey for 124 bucks. Or no, no. For 50 or 62. You do want my one thing of rice? No, no, no. I'm not giving you that. Oh, I do have a bunch of leather you can have. Yeah. Take all that. Um, should I sell you my steel? That sounds like a bad idea. Take my pants. That's fine. You do have food. Um, I can sell my, my bed, eh? I'll, yeah, take it. Refrigerators. A fox fur royal chair. Hmm. Surgeon's headgear. Headgear. Tactical vest. Uh, flower. We could buy... We could buy um, some food from these guys. Unfertilized quail eggs. Wheat. Rice. Which I, already, I can't buy rice from them. I can buy, buy wheat from them. Some cougar meat. What's the best thing to keep around? Probably the wheat. Well, no, I can't eat wheat. We can buy a little bit of cougar meat, though. Do I really need to do this? Uh, probably not. I can go pick berries. 
um, which can get us by. And we can also we have rice over here we, we can pick. Um, so that's not a, not a problem. The um, Oh, this is a long answer. i got to call it a day here. Um, well, I'm going to take this money, and I'm going to go immediately come over here and talk with Alvo. And I'm going to go buy two more things of medicine. Okay, I would like two more things of medicine, please. And keep... Ooh, banana soda. we got survival meals there, too. Those things last forever. Um, okay. Accept. And I got to call it a day here. So I'm going to do that. Thanks again for watching. Um, if everything goes right, I'm going to turn... Before I forget, turn her back on. I think we can save her now. We got, f what, five of those... those uh, Health kits. Let's put her back on medicine. And uh, you're not, you're right, you need, you're at major. You can't be tended to now. You need to be tended to immediately. And you are uh, tended to in two hours. I think we've got both of them safe because I think that better medicine will make a big, all the difference. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time. Well, I almost did something really stupid. Well, in fact, I did do something really, really stupid, but I, c I can fix my mistake. Fix my medicine. I sold my medicine off. I'm going to buy the medicine back. Okay. I just needed to make sure we got that fixed before uh, <laughs> before we ended this. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.